Mike here from New Biome Systems. I just wanted to quickly show you how to set up from scratch your uh, video templates that you're going to be using to send out to your customers when you get them. So if you've installed OpenOffice, which I hope you have, you should be able to go to programs. And if you haven't already, just pause it now and go and do that. So go to programs, find your OpenOffice. We want impress. Okay. Open that. We're going to do an empty presentation. We're selecting our background. I'm going to select notebook, which I've used in the next video as well. And there it is. And next, and crack. Okay. Now you're going to see these things here. You can just click in here. Uh, my title. Okay, well, we can just make it bigger. Uh, we'll add a drop shadow, change the color, and we're going to put something in here. Presents. Hold down the shift key and highlight it, or whatever, however you highlight. Um, I'm just going to select a different text. I'm going to make that really big. I'm going to bold it. I'm going to give it a drop shadow. And I'm going to change the color of that text as well. Dark brown or something. Okay. So I've done that. Now what we want to do is down in here, we've got custom animations and slide transitions so for custom animations I want this text to, to come in first so highlight the text, go add fly in uh, slowly or medium ok and I want that to happen automatically with previous I can set where I want it to come from and the next one I'm going to do is I'm going to do that one <coughs> I'm going to add an effect I'm going to go dissolving and I want that to happen medium okay and I want it to happen after the previous one so after my title I want that one to do then I want to add some right we're done with that and now for the transition so when the slide appears what I want to happen I want some music to start oops I'll just pick one okay and I want that to happen automatically after one second. How do I want this page to appear? I want it to dissolve. Cool. Done that page. I like that. So we're highlighting the left side there. Get copy. Get paste. <coughs> paste again. And paste again. Now we'll go to slide two. I've clicked on slide two. Bit free videos here, video here. I'm going to get rid of this whole box. So highlight the box, delete, insert, picture, from file. Uh, I'm like that one there. Okay, open. Drag it down here. Do a bit of resizing to fit. Drag this text, highlight the text, 
grab the box, drag it down here somewhere. Now I want the sound to continue from the previous slide, so I'm going to go sound. I click on this up here, then you'll hear a noise. Okay. And then if I go back up and just go no sound, <coughs> what'll happen is the music from the previous one will continue into the screen. We go to the next one. Oh, well we forgot the transition, didn't we? What we, what we want to do currently set to dissolve, you can change it. And I can change this text here to do something different. So if I go custom animations, add we go grand turn medium. Okay. Come down here. I don't want that box. Highlight it, delete it. I'll just change the text to something. Uh, what you'll learn. What you will learn. Okay, so delete that. Highlight, copy, paste. Drag it down. Get some bullet points going. Left side orientated. Uh, get rid of the drop shadow. Change it back to black. And change the size down a bit. Need to watch a little learn and uh, how to do this. Okay, I can just create a new box. Copy paste. So I just went copy paste there, shortcut control C, control V. And this. Right. Now, um, I'll just move that. sure the music keeps playing in that screen so yeah again custom animate add effect random bars okay and I want that not on click but with previous I want this one to do something else altogether well in okay and I want that to happen after previous and this one add plus okay and I want that to happen after the last one so you see they're in order alright um, oh, I'll get rid of that one I've got one too many <coughs> uh, slide transition I want to remember we've got to do if we want the music to keep playing we've got to click up it Change it to no sound. Oops. Okay, and we're done. And we can stick our video in here. Delete. Get rid of that. Delete. Delete. Oops. I like that. Delete. Insert video movie sound. I'm just going to insert that one. Just grab the corners, resize it. Stick it in here. Now, for the video, so remember we clicked on this page here, right? Page 4. We want the video, so is a slide transition automatically no okay stop previous sound so we don't want the music to keep playing in this one okay 
we want it to happen automatically and custom animations click on the sound box that's highlighted go add miscellaneous effects start oops start start media okay okay we're ready to play it let's see how it goes Starts like it. Hey guys, uh, this is Doug Turner from New Biome System. Right, done. Um, one small problem. This one here did not appear automatically, the page. So if I go to transition, slide transition. It's, it should have happened. Was it that one or this one? Nope, that's fine. Maybe I didn't wait long enough. But anyway, that's basically how to do it. I'll show you a little bit more in the next video. Thanks a lot.